Yo, it's a model. Soldiers out there, fans out there, followers out there, leaders out there. Tattoos. Um, hey, I'm going to be dropping some great tutorials. I went through all my uh, my media, and I've got some snippets and shit like that, but really, I don't know if I want to launch those. Uh, um, I want to start taking some trips. If I could uh, get my ish together and get some of that and start traveling, um, L.A. is going to be first, then I'm going to go to the Midwest, and then I'm going to go to the East Coast. So wherever I'm at around that area, you guys hit me up. You've been hitting me up. I will come and visit you. I will hold you to it. You guys want to um, fill up some of this, some of this body? Uh, I got some stuff on the back that I want. <laughs> you guys need to like fix this stuff up, fix my back up. I got some stuff over here. I tried to do the P9 right there. It didn't fly. I can't. I can't get it. I mean, this arm's toast. So I'll let you guys work on that bad boy too. Uh, you might as well. Everybody else has. Might as well uh, chop it off and keep tatting it. Uh, hang, hang it up like Dahmer. 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 Jeffrey. Anyway, stick it in the freezer. But check it out. This is where I want to take it. We, I have a lot of things going on right now. A lot. I mean, some of you might think I'm a flake and I've disappeared and I've already explained it in the last video on what happened. It's legit. Now, um, Facebook's hopping. It's not really where I want it to be. A lot of people aren't really active like they were before. But, I mean, that's okay. It's just a slow ride. Ride it slow and easy. That's fine. I'm cool with that because it just takes a lot of stress away from my day. Um, now, a lot of you guys have to understand something. I cannot respond to all your emails. I cannot. I'm sorry. I, I don't have go go gadget umpteen fingers. I don't I just don't have it. I'm sorry I can't do that. But uh, if you get onto Facebook, I mean I can handle it a little bit more appropriate. Uh, granted we're not we're approaching the four hundred mark there, but you know what I'm saying? Primarily what I could do is I could kind of go th and sift through things and see what the general consensus is and then just do a uh, reply all to everybody. Um, at P9 info info at P9 Customs right now the website's not up through GoDaddy but uh, I'm probably not going to even use GoDaddy but right now I'm using GoDaddy for info at P9Customs.com. You guys can email there. I have three people that work through that to help me with that as well because there's a shitload of requests and product requests and movement requests and stuff like that. Here's the bottom line because I said I wouldn't talk long so I'm going to try to rush this. Where am I at? I can't, uh, four minutes. Okay, so that's pretty good. Um, what we want to do right now is reorganize this on onto a proper level and a proper start. Okay, um, kind of clean the slate per se. Nothing really bad happened with the exception of what happened in my personal affairs and my, my family and, and my personal things. Uh, I don't have much family left for anything else to happen to. Knock on fucking wood because I got my kids. But, um... Listen, I want whoever's tracking, whoever loves this, whoever loves the passion for what you're doing, and I know a lot of you do or you wouldn't be viewing, go over to my Facebook right now because what's going to happen is I'm going to launch the movement, uh, movement.com or whatever name I decide or we decide. I like to work with you guys. If you're part of the movement, you're part of my team, and I'm going to freaking work with you on that level. I like to work with you on that level. I'm not going to be no snooty freaking guy. I try to respond. You guys know that if you know me. Uh, I'm a down-to-earth real motherfucker, period. That's it. That's that's all there is to it. I've had a couple of you guys call me. Uh, I won't mention any names, but in regards to a couple of other channels and a couple of other people, I'm cool with, you know, someone called me, you know who you are. You're good, my eyes, brother. You know, by you calling me, I know that a lot of things are here saying I don't even want to deal with the drama. You know what I'm saying? You're a good dude. I always knew you were a good dude. As far as the other cats, you already know what's going down with the other cats. You already know what's going on with other channels and shit like that. We don't even need to get into that because I'm on a whole different level than that guy. I don't even care, and I won't mention any names. Uh, it, it doesn't matter, man. I feel bad, really. I feel bad for people. I feel bad for that person. Whatever, man. He's just... You can't do those kind of things in this life. Um, you learn your lesson quick. What I want to do is I want to get you guys over. Ow. I just set up my balls. Okay. 
Ugh. Et. Excuse me. Huh. Oh, I just sat on my right testicle. Oh, that hurt. Damn. Okay. Ugh. Sometimes, ladies and gents, it doesn't pay to be Italian. Let me tell you what. Try to jump on a bike hella fast. Like, boom. Crush a nut. Not cool. Uh, beyond beyond, and besides that point, uh, listen, go over to the Facebook, man. A lot of you guys, for some reason, you don't know how to get a hold of me. Uh, 408-483-3903. When you text me and I like you, I'm going to hit you back. Granted, it might be a while, but I'll get back to you. That's a fact. You guys calling me. I, I like talking to you guys. Call me up. I'll chat with you. Ask me a question. I'm cool. You know, I might not be the best tattoo artist in the world, but I can freaking teach it. I know my shit. I know I can build these things, and I can build superstar, rock star freaking machines, and I can take my black book and show you. Hey, I'll give you. Nah, I can't give you that one. That's a million dollar product. All right. Can I give you a shitty one? Something that's not going to make too much money. Let me see if I can get you one real quick. Eh, P9. Okay, P9 Shields. P9 Shields, here you go. Corporations out in the world, I got a million more. You want them, you can have them. Tattoo companies, all you guys. I won't mention no names, but uh, any one of you tattoo supply companies out there want to take this one, have it. It's called P9 Shields with a Z. And what it does is the actual shields that go over your uh, your coils, and this isn't a big one, so I'll give it to you. Um, they're, they're shields that can go over your coils, and they have designs on them, and you can you know, change them in and out, and they're interchangeable, and they just kind of clip on and protect that. Not only do they protect it, they're, um, they're stylish, and they keep it sanitary and the coil safe, and you can actually autoclave them so, or ster- sterilize them, sanitize them. So they're cool. P9 Shields with a Z. You can have it. You can have it for free. I mean, it's probably not going to make you a million bucks on that little one, but someone will buy them. You just clip those bitches right on. Bam. Who wouldn't want it? It's just like having, you know, those little custom design things around your coils. Me, personally, I like the coil wires. And wait until you see some of my machines, ladies and gents. Nobody. 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 I repeat, not even Godoy uh, has what I have coming out. And Godoy's badass, bro. Uh, Steve is... That man, I don't know him personally, but I will tell you his work and his machines. I love his machines, man, especially the uh, the square coils. Those things are badass. To me, those are like the solibaric kickers. You know, you take a circle, boom, 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 it's rattling the trunk, but then you t- take a square, and that shit's just blowing out windows. And then you look at how he did it and implemented the, the coils and how it sits is it's like the Harley Davidson engine, and it's like this. Common sense and science will tell you that you're, you're spreading that, that wave. Whoop, you, you spread it out. I mean, that's smart. That's genius. And that's why you got international patents on it. And that takes a lot. Godoy, good job, bro. I love your work. Um, but uh, you have some competition coming up. Know thy name. K-A to the G-E. Absolutely. Absolutely. Bam. Uh, ladies and gents, check it out. I want you guys to go to Facebook. If you want to get a hold of me, I mean, I don't care if you do or you don't. Really, social media to me is just another freaking headache. But at the same time, I enjoy communicating with you people. When you people become troops, I really like to associate with you. We have so much good freaking work coming out of these guys. Pro artists, back up what you say about scratchers because we are changing this shit. We're doing it now. We're going to do it in the future. It's not going to be stopped. We're unstoppable, and it can't happen. It's not going to happen. Tosso, come here and say hi. You've grown a little bit. I want you to say hi to the world. What happened to your hair? Hold on. Jump up here a little bit. Here. Hi. Say hi, B. That's the world. That's the world, isn't it? Yeah. You remember about a year ago we got on here? Yeah. Huh? Give me a kiss. Good boy. You love daddy? Yeah. Do you love the world? Do you love the movement? Yeah. What's the movement about? Aliens. What? Aliens, brother. Aliens? It's not about aliens, brother. What is it? It's about tattooing. Oh. You love tattoos, don't you? Yeah. All right, say goodbye to the world. Bye. Say bye, troops. Bye. No, 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 jump up here and say bye, troops. Bye, troops. 
Okay. All right. Go play. All right, you guys. I'm making a video. Skirt. Skedaddle. Like a mouse. Yeah, you could have some juice. Uh, gotta love them. So, where were we? Um, yeah, hey, come over to the Facebook page. I love associating with you guys. I do as much as possible. You already know what I'm doing and I'm, what I'm trying to do. And it's freaking frustrating. All right. Um, please, if uh, you want to get out of this realm and go into another media outlet, go to Facebook for now until the website's launch. I'm not going to be on Facebook after that, guys. I'm, I'm just going to tell you the truth. If you guys get over to Facebook and the quickest and easiest way that you become involved in the movement is there. And then from there, it's more structured and organized. And then we just take you from there and transfer you over to the uh, other server platform and the website once it drops. The movement website. It's going to be that easy. And that's why use that outlet. You know what I'm saying? Not only that, you can post your flash. We're going to be doing some contests. You're going to uh, – it's fun, man. Um, you can you can show off your shit. If you're bad, it doesn't matter. If you're just starting, it doesn't matter. If you're a pro, it doesn't matter. If you've got 180 years of tattooing experience, it don't matter. You guys all can contribute something to something. When The, the new cats need your guys' expertise. They need you guys with that. When they're being critiqued, it's all professional. We moderate that. We make sure that it's all in respect to the next artist. I mean, this stuff is real, guys, and, and that's what this is all about, okay? It's, it's making sure that everybody has the freedom of expression without being, uh, uh, without being just demoralized and, and pretty much kicked in their ribs with their tail between their legs to never, ever pick up a machine or a pencil again. No. If you have the passion inside you to do it, then do it. It Art is emotional, and it doesn't matter. It, I don't care if you're copying something and you're looking at something to draw it or if it's coming out of your mind or if, you know, it doesn't matter. Now, it does matter if you're stealing stuff and you don't give credit to the other artists that you're taking it from. You can copy work. There's nothing wrong with that. Where I would have a problem, and I guess everybody else should too, is if you're stealing work from people and claiming that it's yours. You cannot steal someone's work, especially tattoos. That's a good way to get your freaking head kicked in. Because you know what? Someone designed that. And as artists, you all know, as well as I know, it's emotional, okay? And when, when people are locked up in the pen, what do you think they do? They draw. And why do they do that? They draw or they tattoo. And why do they do that? Because, and I'm talking about a male institution. Okay, females do it as well, but a male institution. Why is that? Because it's a release. It's just like getting it on, but with something different. You're, you are push, you're pushing out an emotion, whether it's on paper, whether it's pastels, whether it's charcoal, watercolor, or tattooing. You are doing something. For me, it's the learning. It's, 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 it's so fucking hard that it's a challenge, number one, for me. This is for me. It's a challenge. It's always a learning experience that I'll never, ever, ever get 110% on. Ever. I always have to learn in this business. I will never, ever be topped out. Never. No matter how good I get, I'm never going to top out. I'm always going to learn something new with this trade. Also, when you can put art on someone's skin that they're wearing for the rest of their life and they love it, for me, that's awesome. Now, I haven't had any tattoos given that I've never given any tattoos that people have loved. Like when you see on the, you know, LA Inc. or something like that. And they're like, hi, she, Kat Von D's like, so you love it? And then the chick's like, yeah, look at it. It's a chest stamp. And she loves it. Yeah, look at it. It's a chest stamp. And she loves it. I've never got that, bro. I I'm just going to be honest. I have never, ever got, yeah, I love it. I, I think I will. I'll get there. <laughs> I just tattoo myself. You know what I'm saying? And I'll fuck myself up.
but I do it for you. I sacrificed my left arm for you. I did. I really did. I'm not kidding. I did. But I want to take, uh, I want you guys to get over to Facebook, request an ad like that. You can get into uh, Flash Fridays. Flash Fridays, you come up with Flash. It could be your own, be your own. I would rather it be your own, but it, it, it doesn't matter. Look, if you got to look at something to do it, do it. Um, we're going to have some watercoloring classes and courses. It's not going to be mandatory like before. I don't want it to be structured how it was before. I want a lot more freedoms, but actually with the people in the movement, I trust they will push the movement. The movement is, is big, guys. It is. And a lot of people from around the world, and I can tell you that for almost a year, um, there are a lot of people on board with this and you definitely want to be involved in this. If if you are, I don't care if you're in a shop or in the streets, you know how many shop guys have hit me up and said that they learned shit in their apprenticeship? Zero. Squat. I believe it. You know how many shop guys that are currently on the chair in a booth right now, renting out a spot in a shop that say, you know what? I track you. I follow you. I believe what you're doing. And you know what? Kudos. Because this time last year, I wasn't sure where shops were. Because every freaking shop that I visited was totally against it. Uh, we'll kick the shit out of Scratchers, dog. You know, fuck them. Uh, they don't know what they're doing. They shouldn't be out there spreading disease. Man, I can tell you right now, I'm compiling a list of shops in America that have spread hep C and been sued. So, you know what? Hey, let me tell you something. That is why we're here. That's why I'm here. That is what I'm doing. I believe that proper education, you're not going to stop the hype. You're not going to stop it. Whoever you are against me and my movement and our movement and our revolution, peaceful art thing that we got going on, all right, you're not going to stop it. It is a trend that is out of control. You have no control. We live in a world that should have freedom. Not this bullshit sanctions on artistic ability. You cannot take art from us. I was talking about the pen. They draw and they tattoo because you can't take that. COs can't take that. The state can't take that. Nobody can take that away from anybody. It's freedom and expression. And it's amendments and constitutional rights whatever country you live in. And let me tell you something. You will not take it from us. We are getting deep and we're going to get deeper. And I'm going to tell you another thing. You ain't taking it from me. You're not going to take it from me. I'm going to go to the top. And my troops and everybody associated with the movement are too. There's a lot of incentives. There's a lot of things coming. Now, you guys could say, oh, it ain't going to happen. It's all good. I don't care what you think. I didn't think my mom was going to die. I didn't think that was going to happen, but it did. So you know what? Because of that fact right there, that lady, she's going to push me. And if I don't do it, she's going to bitch slap me spiritually. So, you know, it, it is what it is. I got to do it. I'm going to do it. It's going to take blood, sweat, and tears to do this, and it already has. But I'm going to tell you one thing. I'm not going to stop till I drop, and you know it. And you guys that know me, that invite me to your spot, you know it too. And that's why I'll be a good friend to you. And you know I'm loyal, and you know I'm going to get it down because I know you guys are too. And there's a lot of me's out there, and you're watching it right now. You're watching it right now, and you know that you're never going to give up, don't you? You're never going to give up, are you? No, you're not. And you're going to be part of something big. And that big is the movement. And you know why? Because I believe in you. That's why. So don't give me no shit. You guys know this. And that's why you get up right now and you go and you get into it. You know why? You know why? Because you know it's true. I get chills because I know it's true. Go over to my Facebook. Facebook.com backslash Kjaka. Do the damn thing. I'll add you. I'll, you know, get get down. We'll do Flash Fridays. We'll do some other stuff. We'll have some fun there. Post your work. Get, uh, get critiqued. There's things that you could talk to the other people in. Um, get hooked up with supplies. There's people that make machines, uh, et cetera, et cetera. So you know, hey, I'm all for this, guys. Once the website's launched, everybody from there is going to be bounced over to there. I probably won't do Facebook as much. I'll be running the own sites. But um, let's do the damn thing. That's for this. I will have an official recruitment video coming soon. Facebook and uh, the, the troops that are in there, we have already compiled the older list. We've bumped the older people off that aren't responding, unfortunately. I, I gave you guys a chance to come back. You're not, you're not responding, so you're, you're busy with your life or whatever, and you've dropped out for some sort of reason. I'm sorry you've lost your number. I can't wait. Um, uh, there's too many people requesting to, to, to get this 
process done and underway. So we're going to go ahead and do that. Uh, I promise I wouldn't talk long, but I think that I lied a little bit. Sorry. I don't know. It might be, not be long to you. In the beginning, they were like, damn, you talk too much. Can you shorten them? Now I'm getting like, dude, what happened to all your long videos? <laughs> so, ay, híjole la chingada. Did I say that right? Híjole la chingada. I'm Italian. Um, donde es cervezas? Um, donde es panacha? So, where is the cheese? And where is the cheese? I think. If I offended anybody, I'm sorry. I'm going to get back to you guys. Facebook. Oh, also, real quick. Uh, Beamly.com. Now, Beamly.com. I've been asked to go ahead and uh, host for Tattoos After Dark. Now, I'm going to be doing that. I already have my profile set up. I guess some other things are going to be happening within the next few days. I'll have more information on you guys with that. If you want to see me live for a couple hours out of the week in regards to Tattoos After Dark on Oxygen, uh, go ahead and do that. Go cop a, uh, an account over at beanly.com. Look for me over there. I'll be over there along with troops already following. And let's get that party started. And let's have some freaking fun and talk tattoos late night. Deuce.